Well, welcome back. Winter is here, of course, and that means, unfortunately, flu season is here too. But there are a few soups that can really help boost your immune system to keep you healthy. Health and wellness coach Mariel Heidebrink is here to show us some recipes. Good morning. Thanks for good coming morning. in. Thank you. Thank you. And making the studio smell very, very good. I'm yes. like, I smell some curry around here. There's curry, there's garlic, there's ginger. All there's great lots of good stuff. stuff. Yeah. All right. So what are you making? We're making sweet potato detox soup, which is one of my most beloved recipes, um, and it is filled with lots of immune boost sting goodness. Okay, so what do you have here in the pot already? So right now we just have coconut oil. Okay. It's, I like starting with this as a fat base. I think it it's versatile. It has a high smoke point, so okay. you can really caramelize your your veggies without without any negative impact. Alrighty. So we start by stirring in the mirepoix, which is a flavor base of onion, carrot, celery. It's gonna be the base of a lot of soups. Mm -hmm. um, and then into this I also add for more flavor and some flu flight food fighting kick. Uh -huh. There's garlic, ginger, and jalapeno. Oh, so nice. it's going to clear out your sinuses. Um, garlic has tons of antimicrobial properties. Ginger is great for digestion. So this is like it, everything's going to smell amazing yeah, and tastes like really good. It packs quite a punch too to, to it, help keep you healthy. Yeah, it does. It's a great, I mean, it's a great soup. It's a great winter soup. And then into this, we're going to add curry, I like to use garam masala, but mm. you can also use just a regular curry powder and a bay leaf, and then a little bit of turmeric as well. And in here I have dried turmeric, but you can also use fresh turmeric. Um, and I've brought in some fresh turmeric, so we do have that. I can show you what that looks like. Oh, it's all such wonderful spices. I use a lot of garam masala for, for Indian cooking, yeah. obviously, and it, it's really great, the flavor. It brings that beautiful color, too. Yeah, and the little bit of clove like just adds yeah. this warmness yeah. that I love. So then we're going to add an apple for mm. some vitamin C. Apple okay. a day keeps the doctor away, even when it's in your soup. Um, and that just, it, it brightens everything up. It's a little acidic. I use a Granny Smith apple. Okay. Um, so that's great. And then we add in our sweet potato. This is kind of where the bulk of it goes in. We add in sweet potato. We add in beans for some protein because this is, um, you know, it's a plant-based soup. Yeah. So we're going to add in some garbanzo beans, but cannellini beans or just white beans nice. work great as well. It's so really hearty and filling as well. Super hearty, yeah. super filling. I mean, it's it's definitely a soup that can be your your main dish. It doesn't yeah. have to be a side. And then that is Napa cabbage. Okay. Um, and I just like Napa cabbage. I think it cooks down and the texture is better in the soup. So you just kind of like mix this all up. How long does this hang out? So this, I'm going to add in bone broth. Mm -hmm. And the bone broth really is like the star of the show for mm -hmm. me because I make my bone broth at home. I use a crock pot and um, it is filled with collagen and glutamine and glycine and lysine. So all of these um, minerals that are so good for your yeah. gut health. And that is really important because your immune system is all about gut health. Like 72% of our immune system mm -hmm. has to do with our gut. Making sure everything is yeah. working properly and going well in there, right? Exactly, yeah. So the bone broth is great. And I just cover this and let this simmer for like 30 minutes until everything looks like this. Oh, just <laughs> beautiful. Yeah. What a rich color too. And I, we just have about 30 seconds left. I want to make sure people know too, kind of where they can find out more recipes because you've got a lot of ideas. Yeah, so you can check out my website, which is marielheidebrink.com and I have this recipe and many others on there. But this recipe is actually from my wellness cleanses that I lead seasonally. And I have one coming up in January, and this is like where the soup got started five years ago was oh in that gosh. cleanse. I yeah. just took a bite. It is delicious. There's oh, a I'm really so lovely sweetness to it, too. It's the apple. Oh, I love it. Yeah. Perfect. All right, I was just saying earlier today, I felt like I had kind of a bit of a tickle in my throat, so I'll be heating yeah. this up in perfect timing. Yeah, <laughs> All right, you. thank you. Keep